Hello, welcome to the next episode of Let's Play Crusader Kings 2. Um, I actually did a... I actually played a little bit before I started the video, but it was only maybe a few days. So it seems that our... Uh, we now have a claim on Rons, which is good. So it means that we can go attack them. Raise our troops up. And pause. Oh, sure. Never mind. Uh, sorry, I got to. Can't do it with. My retinue's up. There we go. Claim rounds. Raise my troops. So. Let's have a look. Is there anything there that... 420. There's not really a lot cheap here that I can uh, upgrade. I don't have enough technology points to, uh, to do anything, which is a shame. So, let's see, Thierry... Rubald and yeah, that's fine. He can go on a flank. Ah, uh, I wonder if I can still can I still claim it? Oh, okay. Well, hold on. I'm gonna have to put these troops down again. I'm gonna have to find the leash, declare war. Go. This is the downside of having army. Your army levies up. And it's not so bad with this because I've only got these provinces here to deal with. But when it's. When you're dealing with sort of England and you have troops everywhere, so I have to go through your whole list, make sure you've, uh, you've got them all. So I was also thinking as well that um, I think what I might do is make one of my rulers a sort of one of these pious rulers, sort of like a obviously once I've once I'm running as England, just to because uh, the learning really makes a huge difference to uh, uh, your gaining technology. So my go grandson Godfrey is turning into an arrogant little braggart. I might have to rein him in a little bit. So extra prestige or humility. Um. There we go. Humble. Maybe I'll turn him into the, uh, the pious one. We'll have to see. So. We'll move in and start making a move on there. I don't know how much longer this guy is going to be around, considering he's 64 at the moment. Let's see how my other children are doing. So she hasn't had any kids yet. She's also possessed. Sorry, dude. So he has two kids, and he is gluttonous, great, and he's my other grandson, oh dear, this could be problematic, I wonder if there's... Is there a river crossing? No. So they wouldn't get any penalty. This isn't good. Um, how's he doing down here? Well, at least he's kind of winning. I don't know how he's at 37% when there's all those troops everywhere. 
and he's got like 18,000 troops just sitting here. I mean, I can guess, I guess if it's a case if he doesn't want to uh, raise his ships or something. Well, I'm also hoping maybe that I can't really see what commanders they have for uh, for here. And he's not really that good of a military leader anyway, so I doubt he's going to be leading a charge or anything. Or if he is, it's going to be good for us. And traditionally, whenever I've played uh, older games, this hasn't been really upgraded that much. So, let's have a look to see how these, okay, they're doing a mustering ground, which is good. Um, I could always do like a upgraded keep, I guess, because I think this one's upgraded completely. Or as far as my technology will let me go. Um, yeah, I might have to look at that. Um, or maybe... Okay, Castle Town is as far as it can go. Shit, let's see how this fight's going. Too close to call. Oh, it looks like we might be making some headway here. Yes! <laughs> Look at that. You legend. We got this. See, nothing to worry about. Nice. Look at that. Nice big change in war score. Ah, I knew that was going to happen. Gain prestige and military technology points. Um, so, England. Holy shit. Please tell me, England, that you're... Uh, Ah, oh, there we go. There are the troops. Okay. Whew. I was going to say this isn't uh, this isn't good. Oh, I guess it's because they started taking over some uh, some places. So who's this? He's my courtier. Oh, he's the son of him. Okay, and he's just had a new son. Yeah, I have to admit, I was a little bit worried during that fight because um, they did have more troops, and I was kind of hoping that we'd have an, uh, a defender bonus, but. So, where did all those troops go? They just had a huge stack of troops somewhere that has disappeared. Oh well. Once I get this done, I'll, I'll uh, see if I can give him a hand. I mean, if I can get enough to uh, pick off some of the smaller groups, it certainly wouldn't be terrible. Because there are some small stacks around.
Okay, that was her. So this is going to be done in a minute or two. Nice. It's a little bit more gold, which is always nice to have. Let's have a look. Is there... I know they're Catholic. So it'll take a little bit of time for their uh, culture to change. I watched my son, grandson Godfrey at play with another child yesterday. He noticed he didn't want to share his toys. Um, we'll go for that because diplomacy is always good. Obviously, it, it's based on other people's opinion of you. Um, man, he could lose this. What is he doing? Is he started. I hope we start moving his stacks of troops. Because, I mean, we're at like. You're at minus 55 at the moment, dude. Don't mean to preach to the choir or anything, but. You need more than like. What's that? 38, 58. You need more than like 6,500 troops here. Especially if they still have that stack of like 11,000 lurking about. Well, he's not going to be a marshal, that's for sure. have to give him... see what we can do about giving him a hand. Oh, Burgundy is there. Okay, so I guess that's what... that is what used to be um, Barcelona for a little bit. Now, it looks like Barcelona's just lost everything. Looks like it's been taken over by the uh, Sunnis. Oh no, no, there it is. That's what's left of Barcelona. Unlucky. Willing to uh, die to severe stress. Um, okay. I don't really want to lose a hundred prestige. See, the thing is, even with that war score like that, I'm not sure how much I'm going to be able to do to help him. And I guess I could go in and try and flip over some of this occupied area, but... I mean, it really looks like he just doesn't give a shit about defending it. You know? Now, are you willing to... No, okay, well... Just trying to be nice. Let's see what it's like. It's not bad, actually. Sweet. Maybe a few upgrades. That would be pretty decent. Um, with this, I'm going to hit my dimension size limit. All these troops and no sign of any English troops, like at all. What do you have raised at the moment? A 
while that's happening, um, I should be able to. Oh, good, my wife's pregnant again. So I can increase the keep size. I increase, sorry, upgrade the keep to get 10% levy size increase and garrison size increase. So that'd be an extra 59, 60 troops. Um, that'd be an extra 65 troops. That'd be an extra 55. I'm going to do that. Oh shit, I forgot to put my, um, put you there. Man, what are you doing, England? I think, okay, so that should be... What? Okay, fine, I'll go kill your troops then. I thought you were going to be nice about this, but... I guess you want me to kill all your people as well. So at least I'm not running a penalty or anything. Another bishop! Man. Okay, this should be... 100. Okay. Offer peace and force demands. Yes! Thank you. So now I have that. Is there a revolt risk? It's only 1%, so... I'm not too concerned by that. Let's see if... It's a bit better. Um, I just... Okay, I'm going to disband... <clears throat> Excuse me. And then I'm going to re-raise. And we'll all meet in Anjou. Duke Ralph of Mercia has been imprisoned. What's he been imprisoned for? Oh, okay. I guess that's something local then. There have been a shortage of soldiers. Good. I'm not actually going to put my character in on one of the flanks because he's a coward. Which I don't really want. Um, okay, so we'll have just under 2,000 troops. So what I think we'll do is we're going to try and pick off these smaller um, troops. So then it's not too... Oh, there we go. Uh, um, so he's not a genius. We'll call him Henry. And you require an education, Eleanor. So I will... No, don't want that. Don't really want that. Another possessed person. Holy crap. 
Um, oh, we'll do that. Okay. I will unpause that. So I'll let you head down. So it looks like he's starting to get his head in the game. Maybe he's, maybe he's just like, we're just going to wait for you to arrive. We're, we're going to let you deal with this. Wow, so it looks like Leon and Castile's doing well. How old's my... I... 66 now. 66 and he still manages to get a son. Uh, another, uh, sorry, his wife pregnant. Credit to you, man. So what I think I'm going to do is, um, once I get to the point of becoming, playing my son, I want to start looking at these Sunni areas to try and start taking it over. Because if I can sort of get all the southern part of Spain, that'd be fantastic. So that stack of the English got crushed. So who is he? Yeah, we're not that close. I don't even know who he is. He's like, can you talk to your son? I really don't like this. I was like, all right. So you're heading to there. So hopefully we can catch up. And, uh... It's come to my attention that Chancellor of Vendome Charles has bribed and threatened his way through my domain, trying to get enough people to recognize a claim on my title that he's fabricated for his liege. So who is your liege? There. I do not use it. Because I'm going to fabricate a claim there. Then I'll have a... I can do this all day. So our knowledge is increased, and ah, uh, Richard the Blessed. Oh, he's wounded. Heavy infantry leader, zealous. Look at him go. He's like forty-six now. I, I know what's going to happen. I want to. My character's finally going to die. I want to play this guy, and he's going to die. And it's going to be like son of a bitch. Nice. So, we're going to do a little bit of... Nice. Uh, where are they heading to? They're heading to there. I'm almost tempted, you know, to try and take these people on. Uh, 8th of July, 24th of July. Nah, no, forget it. We're going to go back here. Count John had arrested an armed man with ragged armor and a spotty horse. He says that the man claims to be a hedge knight, but clearly does not believe the statement. Um... Yeah, I, I'm not really that concerned by uh, by that. So I'm actually going to stop it here, because I'm about 25 minutes at the moment. So tune in next time while we continue to try and uh, defend against this holy war. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment. I am actually working on getting the annotations for the next parts at the beginning and the end of the video sorted. So you can easily just click part whatever in the corner. Um, but I've only just started doing it on the first ones. So I'll see you in the next video. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you in a bit.